See what I mean, folks? Probably the best natural overlook in the whole park. And uh, aside from the water tower, but the water tower isn't a natural overlook. It's a man-made. This bluff is not man-made. And Giant City lacks good natural shelters. So, I'm sorry, natural overlooks scenic overlooks so this kind of makes up for it being being the one scenic overlook that is actually pretty cool because you can see quite a bit you can't see too far but you can still get some pretty good shots Well, howdy folks, Sean here from Hiking with Sean on YouTube, and today we are at Shelter One here at Giant City State Park. Shelter One is more than just a shelter, some picnic stuff, and a big bluff. Shelter One is probably the best scenic overlook site in the whole park and to get to that scenic overlook you get you go like you're going behind shelter one there's the parking lot you come straight up here veer right <coughs> and you'll start to see a trail going around these trees if it's a very rainy week, and there's a lot of water in the creeks, you can go right to see some pretty cool water foliage. Just be careful, it's slick. Um, along with this trail, it's very slick when, when wet and when icy. So you just go up this trail. This is not an official trail, but people use it a lot, so I definitely want to make a video about it. And finally, here is the main feature of the scenic overlook bluff. And that's the big overlook. You can see down there where I'm parked. You can see all over. There's even the moon. see quite a bit on this overlook let's see over this way it's Trillium Trail across the road this bluff is popular among climbers that climb out here legally this is a legal climbing spot at Giant City so if you do rock climb this is a place you can do it. And it's popular among rock climbers. I don't rock climb, so. But I'm open to giving it a shot. And this bluff itself is really cool. There's just a whole lot to see here. During wet conditions, there's a waterfall. It's really nice. Um, it's just a really cool place to visit. Makes you uh, proud to visit Giant City, places like this. It's kind of off the beaten path. But everyone knows about it. I'm not telling anyone any secret. Um, just please tread lightly. Don't litter. Pack out what you pack in. And uh, don't, don't carve on the rocks or graffiti or anything like that. Because... If you do that, you're taking away the ability of other people to enjoy this in the future uh, as a natural setting. You know, you may find that areas of Giant City have carvings that occurred in the 1800s, early 1900s, and 
while that may make you think it's okay to do it now, we also have to remember that we're a more civilized, logical, and intelligent society than we were in the 18 and 1900s. Uh, back then, we were about resource consumption. Nowadays, we're about resource preservation, resource conservation. We want to save these areas. Um, so future generations can enjoy them. But if we go carving now and everything, we're just setting an example and ruining nature. And we can't do that. Shelter one, probably the best scenic overlook in the park. Wouldn't you agree? When you're back down from the scenic overlooks, might as well come to the base of the bluff, the base of the bluffage, and check it out. If you follow the bluff line that way into the forest on a wet day, uh, it'll turn. And uh, when it's done doing its S turning, S curving, you'll come to a nice waterfall. So, little secret. But here is the cool bluffage. This is the overlook we were just on top of. And as you can see, there's plenty of picnic tables. Um, you can have a sit, have a picnic. There's a trash can over here. Please throw your trash in there, not on the ground and admire the bluffage. And as you could tell, there are carabiners up there and hooks and stuff for the rock climbing. I don't know the exact words, but there's quite a few on the bluff for multiple climbers. And when climbing season is going on, which is pretty much any warm day, <laughs> um, I notice there's lots of people here. So, what a cool area, huh? So tell me in the comments what you think about Shelter One. That was Shelter One here at Giant City State Park. If you like this video, please hit that thumbs up button. Feel free to leave a comment down below. Tell me what you thought if you wanna see more videos like this one. Please share this video with others, especially on social media. It really helps out when you folks do that. If you're not a subscriber to Hiking with Sean on YouTube, please click that subscribe button today. It's free and it motivates me to continue. Check out the description of this video below to see other ways you can connect to me on the internet, including on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, and even my website at www.hikingwithsean.com. Thanks again for watching another episode of Hiking with Sean. Until next time, I'll see you on the trail.